Hi, this is Sudata. In today's video, we will solve some important questions for UPSC Civil Service Preliminary Examination. All questions are important. Watch the video till the end. Before the video begin, I will request a small favor. Please subscribe our channel and press the bell button too so that you can keep getting notifications. So, let's start the video without further delay. Pahala question hai. Consider the following pairs of declarative arts and state. The curative arts and state Sajabati Kala or Raja Kinimna Liki Jore Par Visar Kare. The curative art Sajabati Kala or state Raja Diagayahe. One Alpana, West Bengal. Alpana, West Bengal. Two Kolam, Karnataka. Three Man Manda, Mandna Gua. Which of the pair given above are correctly match. Upper D gay jory me se konsi jory se hi se mel khate hai. Option dia gaya option e. One and two only cable ek or two option B. Two and three only option C. One and three only option D. One, two, three answer hi e. Option E se hi uttar hi. One and two only cable ek or two pair se hi se match hote hai. Alpana West Bengal ke hai. Kolam. Kolam Karnataka ke hai. So. Answer hai e option is a yutter hai. Next question dekte hai. Next question hai. Who is among the following? Conservation efforts have been taken for the tiger conservation. Baki nimnaliki sangrakson ki prayasu me se konsa liya gaya hai. A statement ya gaya hai. 1. Cats frameworks. 2. TX2 program 3 St. Petersburg declaration for M. Strippies. Select the correct answer using the code given below. Nise de gay code ka upay karke sahi uttar send kare. Option diya gaya hai. Option A. 2, 3 and 4 only. 2, 10 or SAR cable. Option B. 1, 3 only. Option C. 2 and 4 only. Option D. 1, 2, 3, 4. Answer hai. D. Option D sahi uttar hai. 1, 2, 3, and 4. Tiger conservation report liya gaya hai. In saro mein se liya gaya hai. So answer hai D. D sahi uttar hai is question ki. Catch Premox TX2 program St. Petersburg declaration M. Streepes reports have been taken for the tiger conservation. So right answer of this question is D. Option D is the correct answer of this question. Okay, to say the next question, the next question hai. Which of the following are subject to an audit of the Controller and Auditor General of India? Nimna likhit me se kaun sa niyantrak ke lekha pariksa ke adhin hai aur bharat ke mahalekha pariksa. Statement diya gaya hai. Statement 1. Union and State Government Department, Sangha or Rajya Sarkar ke bibhaag. Statement 2. Foreign state receiving grants from the Union Government, Kendra Sarkar se anudan prapt karne wale Bideshi Rajya. Statement 3. Telecom Regulatory Authority of India, Bharat ke dur sangsar niyamak pradhikaran. Select the correct answer using the code given below. Nisi de gay code ka upay karke sahi uttar send kare. Option diya gaya hai. Option A 1 only. Option B 2 and 3 only. Option C 1 and 3 only. Option D 1, 2 and 3. Answer hai C. Option C sahi uttar hai. 1 and 3 only. Cable A code 10 bayan chahi hai. So answer hai C. Union and State Government Departments and Telecom Regulatory Authority of India are subject to an audit of the Controller and Auditor General of India. So, right answer of this question is C. Option C is the correct answer of this question. Next question that they have. Next question here. Consider the following statement regarding the eighth schedule of the Indian Constitution. भारतीय संविधान के आठ अनुसूची के संबंध में निम्नलिखित बयानों पर विचार करें। Statement one, the Constitution mentions the qualifying criteria for a language to be included in the schedule. संविधान में एक भाषा के लिए qualifying मानदंडों का उल्लेख किया जाता है अनुसूची में। Statement two, the office 
The official language of the Indian Union is not mentioned in the eighth schedule. Bharatiya Sangha ki adhikarik bhasa at anususi me ullik nahi hai. Statement 3. Tulu language is the latest language included in the eighth schedule. Tulu bhasa at anususi me nahi bhasa hai. At anususi me shamil kya gaya hai. Which of the statement given above are correct? ऊपर दिए गए कथन में से कौन से कथन सही है ऑप्शन दिया गया है ऑप्शन ए वन ओनली सिर्फ ऑप्शन बी वन एंड टू ओनली ऑप्शन सी वन टू एंड थ्री ऑप्शन डी नन आंसर है डी ऑप्शन डी सही उत्तर है नन एक भी बयान सही नहीं है सो आंसर है डी ऑप्शन डी सही उत्तर है बयान वन गलत दो और तीन तीनों ही गलत है इसलिए आंसर है नन स्टेटमेंट रिगार्डिंग दी एट के दलाव दी इंडियन कंस्टिट्यूशन दी कंस्टिट्यूशन मेंशन दी क्वालिफाइंग क्राइटेरिया फॉर अ लैंग्वेज टू बी इंक्लूडेड इन दी स्केडल इस रॉंग स्टेटमेंट स्टेटमेंट टू दी ऑफिशियल लैंग्वेज ऑफ दी इंडियन यूनियन इस नॉट मेंशन इन दी एट स्केडल ऑफिशियल लैंग्वेज ऑफ इंडियन यूनियन इस मेंशन इन दी एट स्केडल सो दिस स्टेटमेंट आल्सो रॉंग Tulu language is the latest language included in the eighth schedule. Eight schedule. Tulu language is not latest language which included eight schedule. So this statement also wrong. So answer is none. Uh, with this I conclude today's video. I uh, will meet you next video. Till then bye. See you soon.